There were 4,172 homes sold on the MLS in the region last month. This is up 36% compared to last year. It's also 56% above the 10-year February sales average, and it ranks as the highest selling February on record. We're beginning to see home listings increase as we head towards the spring market. However, additional supply is still needed to meet today's demand. There are 7,299 homes currently for sale on the MLS in Metro Vancouver. This is a 39% decline compared to last year, but is a 10% increase compared to January of this year. Sustained home buyer competition is keeping upward pressure on home prices across the region. The benchmark price for all residential properties rose to $795,500 in February. That's a 22% increase over the last 12 months. At 27%, detached homes have seen the largest increase over this period, while condos and townhomes have increased about 17% each. To help us better understand the strength of today's market, we measure home buyer demand fueled by home sales against home seller supply fueled by the number of home listings. This measurement today gives us a sales to active listings ratio of 57%. This is reflective of a seller's market. Generally, analysts say that downward pressure on home prices occurs when the ratio dips below the 12% mark, while home prices often experience upward pressure when it reaches 20% in a particular community for a sustained period of time. This brings us to this month's RealtorView segment. This month, we're looking at being a home buyer in a seller's market. Entering a seller's market can be exciting and intimidating for home buyers. Deals tend to move more quickly in this environment. Most listings have multiple offers and very few subjects. This is why it's essential to be prepared. It's important to secure pre-approval for financing and have a firm budget. You'll want to have a clear idea of what you want and an understanding of pricing trends in your neighborhood of choice. Realtors are there to help you from beginning to end. They provide you with professional representation. They can help you analyze the market, navigate and negotiate in a multiple offer situation, and create a contract that looks out for your best interests. There are opportunities and risks in every market. You need to understand both. The best way to do this is to hire professional representation and to do your homework. For further housing market information, go to the news and statistics section of this website. For the Real Estate Board of Greater Vancouver, I'm Darcy McLeod.